Hi, my name's Michelle. I'm one Hi, of the Michelle. discharge coordinators here at Mercy. Last winter, Tony Gabamondi was admitted to the hospital with a stroke. He received care at Buffalo Mercy Hospital, and when his condition was stable, he was admitted to Partners in Rehab Medical Rehabilitation Unit, otherwise known as an MRU. The MRU provided the physician and nursing oversight, along with medical rehabilitation to help him function independently. Anthony's goal? To get back to doing the things he's always enjoyed. Most often, the MRU is recommended for patients with strokes, other neurological disorders, hip fractures, and conditions that require physician oversight. At an MRU, the patient has access to 24-hour physician and nursing care, along with intensive rehab services six days per week. At the Catholic Health System, the Partners in Rehab staff focused on Tony's individual needs. The interdisciplinary team helped develop and implement a rehabilitation program designed to improve his health, functioning, independence, and quality of life. Let's meet the members of Tony's team. Our board-certified physiatrists, who are specialists in medical rehabilitation, evaluate the patient's medical condition and rehabilitation needs in conjunction with the rest of the partners in rehab team. The physician prescribes any appropriate medications or medical treatments along with a rehabilitation therapy plan that will restore strength and functioning as quickly and as safely as possible. Throughout Tony's stay on the MRU, the physician conferred with other members of the team to evaluate his progress and modify the treatment and therapy plan as needed. The physician, or one of her colleagues, is also available 24 hours a day to respond to any medical emergencies that might arise. Registered nurses, who specialize in rehabilitation, coordinate the overall care of the patient. They also evaluate the patient's requirements for nursing care, develop a nursing care plan, and make sure nursing care needs are managed throughout a patient's stay in the MRU. In this supportive environment, their focus is prevention, maintenance, and restoration of function. The team of nursing staff provides care around the clock, seven days per week. Nursing assistants help patients when they need assistance with activities of daily living, like bathing, grooming, or getting dressed. As the patient is stronger, the nurse assistant won't need to help as much, although she or a colleague is always nearby if help is needed, or if they just need someone to make them smile. An occupational therapist, or OT, helped Tony learn to do certain activities of daily living that were difficult to perform because of his condition. After a stroke, patients may have trouble with dressing and motor skills. The OT teaches patients how to use assistive devices like this tub bench, which will make it easier to bathe or shower until they have regained enough strength and control to do this without the device. Another clinician on the team who worked closely with Tony throughout his stay in the MRU was the physical therapist or PT. Their role is to guide patients through physical therapy and exercises that help regain strength, stamina, range of motion, and physical coordination. Sometimes it was difficult work for Tony, but the PT was there to give encouragement and support. The objective is to help patients reach their goals as soon as they're able. Another team member is the speech-language pathologist who helps patients, like Tony, regain the ability to speak or comprehend language that might have been lost due to the stroke. Our speech-language pathologists also can use specialized tools and techniques to help patients overcome difficulties with swallowing that might result from certain medical conditions. They also assist the dietitian in developing meal plans that will provide proper consistency and nourishment for each patient. Other members of the MRU team include the chaplain, who handles the individual needs of the patient and family and provides input at the plan of care meeting, and a social worker who assists our patients and their families by making appropriate arrangements for their discharge to home or another setting if necessary. This might include special equipment needs, in-home nursing or rehab services, or arranging appointments for outpatient therapy. Partners in Rehab MRUs recognize that patients and families need an ongoing support system and have partnered with the Stroke Association of Western New York. Their volunteers provide support to patients and their families while working through the rehabilitation process in the MRU and also after their return to home. 
Most importantly, all of these caring and compassionate individuals we've met work together as an interdisciplinary team to ensure that patients like Tony achieve their optimal outcome as quickly and safely as possible. We are committed to maintaining the highest of standards and therefore we continuously measure our patients' outcomes. The results are very reassuring. Our outcomes are consistently at or above the national standard. Our patient satisfaction is evident with positive results in overall satisfaction and recommendations to our facilities. Beyond our positive outcome data and patient satisfaction surveys, we see evidence every day that our Partners in Rehab MRU team is fulfilling the mission of the Catholic Health System and its long tradition of healing with compassion and respect for the unique needs of each person we serve. You can tell the people that work there like their jobs and they like each other and it makes it a friendly atmosphere and you feel comfortable there. To have yourself feel that they know what they're doing and that they care about you means a lot and that's how you feel when you're there.